help. Our governor has shut down our schools. We're not supposed to leave our home. I've got my kids full time. And I'm going crazy trying to find meaningful activities. What can I do? Hey, Bob Shogren here. If this is you and you're wondering what to do with your kids because they've had way too much screen time as it is, help is on the way. In fact, you could be doing something with your kids within minutes of finishing this video that will not only be productive, but help them become the mature young men and women you want them to be. And it's only $10. Your help is found in two digital cartoon books, but these aren't just regular cartoons. These are character development cartoons. That's right, cartoons to develop your child's character. Children as young as six years old are being affected by these cartoons. And to say that my daughter's character has changed because of it has been an understatement. It just, as soon as she started reading it, or I started reading it to her, it just clicked in her little six-year-old mind. She got the whole difference between a cat and a dog and their attitudes. And even after we read the book, there would be like character issues that would just come up throughout the day. And I would just say, is that a catitude? And it would immediately, she would immediately get it and she would immediately like change her behavior. So what's this cat and dog analogy about? We help build character into kids through a simple joke about the differences between a cat and a dog. A dog says, you pet me, you feed me, you shelter me, you love me. Oh, you must be God. A cat says, you pet me, you feed me, you shelter me, you love me. Oh, I must be God. Because all kids can relate to cats and dogs, these cartoons really help them think through, am I being selfish in how I'm living, or am I trying to help others? In other words, am I living like a cat or a dog? These cartoons have everyday scenarios your kids will find themselves in. Here's a sample. When cats and dogs are asked to take out the trash, a cat whines and says, you always ask me, can't someone else do it? Whereas a dog simply says, Yes, Mom, I'll do it now. There are four great ways to use these cartoons. First, discuss them with your children and ask them if they want to be the cat or the dog and why. Second, ask them for different ways the cat or dog could respond to one of these scenarios. Third, have them act out the cartoon. Let them take turns being the cat and the dog. And then you be the cat and show them what a whiny cat is like and really ham it up. They'll be laughing hysterically. Then they'll see how silly their own whining is. And finally, create other scenarios not found in the book, but are found in your home and ask them what a cat or dog would say in those situations. Hey, listen, the coronavirus is upon us. These are wacky weeks of being forced to stay at home with the kids. Though you're crazy about them, you can still use help. Download these right now and begin working on them with your kids. To get these cartoons, just click on the Shop Now button below this video. It'll take you directly to our store where you'll find the cartoon books ready to download for just $10. You can download them in full color pictures so you can discuss them with your children digitally, or you can download them in black and white so they can color them. You could literally be printing out cartoons for the kids and have them coloring minutes from now knowing you're developing their character. So okay, yes. The governor canceled school and you're not supposed to leave your home. But you've got this. You're going to rise above this storm and find the sunshine. You're going to use this coronavirus timeout with your kids and not only survive, but thrive by teaching them character development that will change their lives forever. Woohoo! Way to go, Super Mom.